This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Vanessa Villaforte with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. The Henry Dorley Zoo's Wildlife Safari opened up on Friday for the season. The drive through park will be open every day through October from 9 a.m. to 5. What makes the park so unique is that you can check out animals that reside in North America and Nebraska on a four mile stretch from the comfort of your car. For almost everyone else, the pandemic really hit hard, but at the Wildlife Safari Park, it set its attendance record at the beginning of the pandemic. Well, King Lear, one of Shakespeare's most popular tragedies, opened at the Blue Barn Theater Thursday night for a three-week run. The play is an intimate look at the life of an aging monarch who chooses to divide his kingdom between his three daughters. This decision brings disaster and chaos to the realm, making for a story of power, love and madness. Director Jill Anderson says the play expands on the human experience and has themes that anyone can relate to. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist Chris Swain, 49 degrees for Saturday. That's much cooler than where we were on Friday. But I think one big pattern change that a lot of us will enjoy is wind starting to calm down a little bit more. Gusts topping out at 20 miles per hour. It's noticeable, yes, but just for some perspective, we had wind gusts on Friday in the range of 40 to 50 miles per hour. Much more tolerable there. Seven day forecast features the 40s for the weekend under partly cloudy skies. We're back to 60 by Monday, and that's when the heat really starts turning up. Into Tuesday, we get back to 72. Rain chances work their way in late Tuesday night into Wednesday. Even a switch over to some wintry mix is possible. A very familiar pattern from what we just went through last week. 48 on Thursday, back to the mid 50s by Friday. 